This is an extremely dangerous design. The can is painted, the base of the can is painted, the ground wire is attached to a lug that is then placed between the base and the can and a screw is set through all that. Idea being any voltage that goes to the chassis will go to the lug of the ground wire and then that should go to ground. If I touch the can since it's painted you will not hear my continuity alarm go off. If I touch the lug itself you can hear it. Now then I'll touch the screw which is connected to the can bolts through the lug to the uh, base. Deader than a doorknob. That means the ground wire is isolated and not doing its job. Lug, screw, lug, screw, base, the can, the base, the can, the lug. To make this safe to operate, you need to sand the paint off and sand it clear down to bare metal here and also on the cover all this area needs to be sanded off so it's bare metal to bare metal so that the lug is then sandwiched between the bare metal of the cover and the bare metal of the base and that way if any electricity and current uh, flows to the base or to the cover it will then go to the lug to the ground wire to ground where it's supposed to be rather than through you. As it is, ground wire should never be uh, sandwiched between or connected to anything that's painted. They always should go to bare metal. As a code requirement of NEC, the National Electric Code, UL will also specify that as well. This ground wire goes to the case of the unit. Should something short out on the coils, it needs to go to a ground wire, and that ground wire then goes to your home main home circuit breaker, and that should trip if the fuse fails to. A lot of things wrong with this. First of all, the ground wire from the mains come in, and then it's soldered on, and there's this loose piece of wire. It's frayed already. Right here, it's, it's frayed. So this contact is questionable. They sort of stripped the, the cover and went a solder joint. The, the wire continues, connects here, but then this is soldered on. And this connection is really woebegone. And this lug connects to the case. Well, that's how good that ground wire is. That should never happen. As you can see now, I pulled that wire off. Another case in point. This is a cold joint. I should have never been able to pull that loose. Two things wrong with this. This should have been a continuous piece of wire to the case because it's your ground. That's what protects you from dying. This is a cold joint, so that would have never uh, brought the current from the case to the ground if your life depended on it. This is a bad design. It is unsafe. Do not operate this. Hope you found this useful. Thank you for watching.